Äh. Was war denn das gerade? Ging irgendwie gerade kein Internet. Doch, jetzt geht's wieder. Okay, komisch. Richtig komisch. Ich muss jetzt mal eben kurz äh, alles neu triggern von meinem Bot zumindest. Das sollte jetzt eigentlich wieder laufen. Hier. Da war ganz kurz mein Internet eben weg. Ich, ich wollte sagen, ich wollte jetzt noch ein Happen essen. Dann geht's geil weiter, ja?
Yo, da bin ich wieder. Wisst ihr, was bei Hunger am besten hilft? Essen. <lacht> Erstmal gegessen, Kippe anstecken. So. Und dann gucken wir uns mal um. Musik wieder aus. Ich will ja auch die... Äh ich hören, die mich anknabbern wollen. Der Schuss ist gut. Was ist wichtig? so ein Gefühl, dass gleich das Licht ausgeht. Ist schon wieder viel zu hell. We need to get you a new Cortex chip, just like the ones you find inside robots, so we can store your brain. Ein Cortex chip. Ja, wo kriegen wir jetzt ein Cortex chip her? Roboter. Hm. Ja, sorry, wenn ich dir Hunger gemacht habe, aber ich erinnere mich, äh, weil ich das letzte Mal was gegessen habe. Holy shit, das ist schon eine Weile her. Deswegen. Irgendwann ist Nahrung auch mal wichtig, ne? Ist ja jetzt nicht so, dass ich ständig esse und dadurch übelst fett bin. Also, ich weiß, vor ein paar Tagen war beim Doc. So für 1,80 Größe wiege ich 80 Kilo. Ich habe wieder ein bisschen zugenommen, aber alles noch im Normalbereich. In Robotern, ja, irgendwo aus dem Roboter baue ich jetzt ein Cortex-Chip aus. Hm. Wie man denn hier einen Roboter analysiert? Aber hier sind ja keine Roboter, hier sind ja bloß Viecher. Hier gab es das Gel. Sieht auch sehr vielversprechend aus. Oh, I know. 
Everything from the sudden signal amplification in black boxes to having a comatose Dr. Ross locked up in the glass jar. We've all been going a bit nuts. Tell me about it. It feels like my head's about to explode. Hypothetically speaking, could we stop the WoW from mutating? It doesn't work like that. Even if there was a site alpha? Hypothetically speaking, I guess we could try Rally, are you recording this? Sorry. I just... Sorry. Gespeichert. So, gucken wir weiter. Hallo Tanja. Willkommen. Ali ist in einem Horrorspiel unterwegs. Aber ich habe das auf Plep Level gestellt, also easy. Das heißt, ich kann nicht wirklich sterben, aber trotzdem ist das noch ein furchteinflößend genug. Hier gehen Cortex Chip raus, hier fräst aus ihm. Also doch. Ich bin schon mal gestorben. Ich bin in die Abyss reingesprungen, also in den, in den tiefen Abgrund hat mein Taucheranzug nicht ausgehalten. Das Setting ist irgendwie. Es sind irgendwie. Maschinen, die denken, die sind Menschen. Und irgendwie wurde ich hier in den... einkopiert. Diesen, äh, diesen Roboter, wo ich jetzt bin. Ah. Oberbereich. Notwendig. Die Geschichte ist ja noch ein klein bisschen komplexer. Ne? Also irgendwie ähm, haben die eine Methode gefunden, die Menschen zu scannen und äh, die, 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 den, deren Persönlichkeit oder Wissen oder sowas in den Computer zu laden. Und haben sie mir versprochen, ich hatte irgendwie einen Autounfall und mir haben sie dort versprochen, dass das halt äh, dadurch hilft, also ich soll mich scannen lassen und so was alles und dann habe ich mich scannen lassen und äh, in dem Moment, wo ich gescannt werde, wache ich in so einem Roboter auf. Sozusagen. Und äh, versuche dann rauszufinden, was mit mir passiert ist und so, stelle dann irgendwann fest, ich bin mit einem Roboter und die experimentieren hier mit irgendwelchen Sachen und da hat auch irgendwie ein Komet die Erde getroffen und alle Menschen sind tot und die haben jetzt die letzten Scans der Menschen, wollen sie denn sozusagen als, als Andenken oder irgendwie so hochschießen ins Weltall. Irgendwie so. Das verstanden. So grob, grob komprimiert und jetzt bin ich gerade auf der Suche nach noch einen ollen Chip. Jetzt werde ich mich noch mal heilen. Also ich denke mal, das ist ein Heilsymbol und ich bin ein bisschen angekratzt oder so. Also irgendwie habe ich mit dieser ehemaligen Sache schon interagiert. Sieht eklig aus, ich weiß. Aber ich weiß nicht, ob ich das mal machen soll. Jetzt ist schon wieder Strom aus. Noch Sachen so nehmen und irgendwie so dichter holen und dann rotieren irgendwie. Aber wenn irgendwas echt dich essen will, dann, dann hast du gar keine Zeit für so eine Details. Darauf zugreifen? Andere 
Seite. <lacht> was ist hier mit Alien-Technologie oder keine Ahnung, irgendwelcher Technologie passiert. Da wäre noch einer, der rumsitzt. Hier wäre noch eine Tür zu öffnen. Das ist nicht so ein Ding, was ich suche. Das auch nicht, das auch nicht. Die Musik, Musik im Hintergrund, die macht mich schon eher, eher fertig als alles andere. Ich erwarte, dass mich jetzt jeden Moment irgendwas anspringt. Jetzt sucht doch noch. Kannst du mir was geben? Kann ich dir ein Cortex-Chip irgendwo ausballern? Nee, ne? Also ich glaube im Normalfall würde ich davon sterben oder Schaden nehmen oder sowas, wenn ich in der Nähe bin und dann diese Bildverzerrung kriege und so. Aber weil ich das halt auf äh, relativ einfach geschalten habe, denke ich mal, komme ich damit klar. Powerpack Storage. drin offensichtlich Nicht so gut aus. Das sieht nicht ganz so gut aus. Ich habe schon die Bützt. Gänsehaut. Ich glaube. Vielleicht. Oh nein! Oh nein! Das ist vielleicht nicht so gut. Lauf! 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 Bruder, lauf! Lauf, Bruder, lauf! Mach alles hinter dir zu! Verdammte Axt, ey. Verdammte Axt. <lacht> ich wäre schon dreimal gestorben, hätte ich das Spiel härter eingestellt, ey. Oh, fuck, ey. Was ist denn hier los, Alter? Überall Dead Bodies. Ohne Kopf ist schlecht. hat auch cool und atmosphärisch das Spiel, ja, also ist voll die 5,59 Euro wert, die ich da ausgegeben habe ich 
sieht hier gleich wieder jemand. Hier überhaupt richtig? Geht hier falsch. <lacht> Idiota. Idiota. Wie habe ich noch nicht? Go look for a robot cortex chip. Oh nö, ne? Jetzt habe ich so einen Akku. Oh, noch ein Robot Cortex Chip. Dann darfst. Wo krieg ich die denn jetzt her? Ich glaube, da muss ich in diese Unteretage. In diesem Kreis da. So eben war ich oben, müsste ich jetzt glaube ich nach unten. So was nicht, hier habe ich das Aerogel. Ja. Naja, ich glaube ich bin richtig, die Musik wird schon wieder so komisch. Genusus, schlaf gut. Und träum möglichst nicht von diesem Spiel. Kann ich das nie aufmachen, das ist aber offensichtlich drin. Verdammt. So.
me. Ich geht ja auch nicht. Hm. Ach so, die muss man erst anschalten. Ne? Ja. Strasky, are you there? I hear you, Herbie. What's up? Uh, just wanted to check in. I have to go do something. I might not be around for a few days, okay? Rally her relieving the listening post? Must be important. It is, Strask. It is. Okay, then. Stay safe. Omicron, can you hear us? Loud and clear. Everyone all right? We will be as soon as we make friends with the power suits. I'm sure you'll get used to it. <laughs> Just wanted to check in before we pass the last working Lumar probe. Guys, any last words to Omicron? Don't forget to pick us up. You uh, heard that, right? Don't worry, we won't forget. All right, heading into radio.
radio silence. Good luck, guys. Tau, please respond. This is Rally Herber calling from Omicron. Please respond, Tau. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Piss off another one of WoW's monsters. We have everything we need, right? Yeah. Let's get to work. you collected. Just stuff all of it into the suit with the dead body. This is crazy. Don't worry, it'll work. Just make sure it's all bunched together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. All right, try activating the suit from the terminal again. I can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was gonna suggest that if you refused. You'd go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it? Change body? Yes. If you want to stay here, I'm not gonna stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would it be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right. Let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. You lost me halfway there. You don't really need to understand it, just make them line up.
You can climb into the pilot seat now. Already? I have everything under control, so please, have a seat. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. It's like having a picture taken. But with the most expensive camera in the world. You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. <laughs> What was that? No, I, it's just... Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn you, Kath. Two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were gonna take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in this fucking nightmare again? All alone? That's so cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... What if he didn't need to wake up? You'd do that? I don't know. Maybe. There. I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer.
we done here? Yeah. Activate the clown, please. Sure thing. Simon, I killed at Omicron. What do you think, Catherine? Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? Is there someone up there who called me an imposter? It's dumb luck, right? That I woke up in the right body. I basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. This is awful. We did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind? Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Please say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I could still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair, and the sun was setting, and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist's brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the Ark, would it be any different? still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends? I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have... <laughs> Stop moving. The power blacked out for a moment. Think it could be the atmospheric pressure. 
It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry. It should hold. Comforting. It will hold. Does... Does time freeze when you're not powered? Time feels omitted when you're not omitted. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or hindered. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. But generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural continuation since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. Stopfe ich mir die Kippe? <lacht> Klar. Oh, good, you're back. What happened? Something dropped onto the cage. Knocks you right out. It spoke to me. Looks like a man, one of Wow's creatures. It just stared at you for a moment, then threw itself down the abyss. It said it would make preparations. I don't like the sound of that. <coughs> it was very strange. I thought it was going to kill you for sure. I'm glad it didn't. Yeah. Me too. Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good. Not sure the climber can take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. Wait, the other you has been here. We're following in old footsteps, Kat. When I had footsteps... You could still be down here somewhere, technically. Don't remind me, freaks me out. Alright, let's head for town and find that arm. gar nicht auf. Was ist das denn? Wo macht das mehr Sinn? So unscharf. Kurz noch Kippe ausdrücken. Geht sofort weiter. Interessiert natürlich auch, wie es weitergeht. Da bin ich gekommen. 
Da wäre eine Tür, wo man rein könnte vielleicht. Hier noch Vieh. Okay, wir sind Vieh. Tau. Gucken wir mal, wo wir überall reinkommen. Stick to the lamplights, they won't go near them. I can't, Valglasser. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the WoW is out of control. She needs to get to Sarang. He'll know what to do. Raj, you can tell them yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the path! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! It's over there! The light is over there! Final push, Ross. Almost there, we just... Ah! Ah!
Can you hear this? Anyone there? This is Tau? Who is this? This is Ian Peterson of Theta calling. I got a team with me, and we're about half a kilometer from Tau. What? How, how did... You came in the climber? Listen, we're having a really hard time with this sector. Heavy turbulence is making it difficult to move forward, and the wildlife you got is absolutely rabid. The storm comes and goes. Instruments show the weather is relatively fair right now. You should move out as soon as possible. Stick to the lights. The critters should leave you alone. All right, you heard the man. We're moving out, people. Tau, keep the doors unlocked. We're coming in. Shit.
Here to be inside. Let's find the Ark. Welcome to Tau. What's left of it? Are you guys all right? What happened here? We ran out of real food long ago. People have been getting sick. Haven't heard from anyone in months. No shit. They all think you're dead down here. Some failed evac story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section to preserve power. All right. See you soon.
Ist gut. Warum kommst du mir mal nach? Verpiss dich doch mal. Geh, geh, geh. 
Thank you. Sack hier. <lacht> Kannst du nicht mal gerade gucken. Maintenance. Warum machst du den Maintenance nicht auf, Mann? Verdammt, du bist du. Ja, ja, komm hier rein. Komm hier rein. Willst du da nicht reingehen? Husch, husch. Ah, was er jetzt noch vorhat, er rennt mir jetzt hinterher. Wie weiß, was das ist. Muss das wohl so. Komm mir nach, Bruder. Aber da ja noch was rausfinden. sind komplex. Ich weiß nicht, wo ich hin muss. Was da schon hier? Hey, aua. Aua, aua. Husch, zu blöd. Ich habe keinen Plan, wo ich hin muss. Das ist das Schlimmste überhaupt. dich nicht digitalisieren lassen, Bruder.
plan. Anyone there? Not in the mood to talk to robots. No Zehnmal hinterher laufen. Weil, wenn du nichts findest, dann hat das Monster irgendwann noch seinen Schrecken verloren. Weil es dann langweilig ist. Weiße. Kontrollraum geht nicht auf. Wieder hinter mir. Mensch, ich möchte doch bloß hier weiterkommen. Ich weiß doch gar nicht, was ich mache. Du denkst hier drauf.
if we had a gun, this would be the time to pull it out. Did not expect it to end like this. Should have jumped the climber back to Omicron. Without the Ark? Forget about the Ark. No, you don't get to say that. It's the only thing left of value. You know that. Yeah, yeah. Promise you won't leave it behind. We'll all be dead one day. Then what? Well, better keep it safe until then. Don't want the wow to take it, swallow it whole. Uh, I'm sorry, Catherine. It's okay, Ian. Just let it out. Let it all out. says we could try again when things calm down you gotta do it you know you got to <laughs> <laughs>
you. You're different. Can I help you with anything? Go ahead. Make yourself at home. Are you human? Sarah Lindwall. Payload technician at your service. A rare sight, am I right? I'd say so. You're the first normal living human I've seen. There's not many left down here. Most of them are up on the plateau. You mean at Omicron? Yeah. There's no one alive at Omicron. You've been there? I've been all over. The power plant at Upsilon. The ruins of Lambda. The abandoned Delta. Theta. You've been to Theta? There's not a lot left of Pathos too. And, uh... I'm the only living person you've met. <coughs> you mean I'm the last living human on the planet? I'm sorry. Who are you again? Simon Jarrett. Stationed out? Nowhere. I, I used to work in a bookshop in Toronto. Long story. Then what the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to find the Ark. Why would you? How do you know about that? I've heard it's the last hope for mankind. Damn right it is. Now, what do you want with it? Take it to the gun at Phi, launch it into space. That was the plan, all right. I've been guarding it ever since we brought it back to Tau. I just couldn't bring myself to let go. To tell you the truth, I don't have the strength to argue. And I certainly don't have the time to wait for the next sentient thing shuffling through here. Go ahead. Take it. Thank you. Can I get you anything? Do anything for you? You could kill me. Good one. You serious about me killing you? No, I'd love to hang around here until I dry up to the size of a raisin. Simon, this Fucking sucks. <coughs> I don't want to live like this. Shouldn't we be doing something to keep you alive? Why? You're the last human. I, I just find it disrespectful to our entire history not to fight this. Sure, we have the Ark, but you're the real deal. Thanks. That's probably the best compliment I've ever got. But the truth is that the Ark is all we have. We'll have to accept second best, you know? None of this feels right. Simon, I want to die. Sarah. Just think about it. Knock it out of the park. Be careful. Good luck, Simon. Go ahead. Go save humanity. What's left of it? Be careful. I still can't believe I'm the last one. It's crazy. Would you stay with me, please? It won't be long now. Just, please, just stay. What a crazy thing this was. Life. At least I won't have to turn 30. Hooray! <laughs> Wish I could have died at home with my friends. Have you ever been to Greenland? It's very beautiful. Well, at least when you get out of the city. Nanok is busy, and yes, there's like 12 million people trying to get around, but it's a great place. Or rather, it was a great place before the comet ended it all. You know what? I prefer it this way. I like to pay thoughts. Liked my colleagues, Ian, Nick, Jasper, even Catherine.
people thought she was weird because she was quiet, but she was cool. Simon, you're still there? I'm here, Sarah. Don't let him die, okay? Send them out there. To the stars.
tell me what you want. I need you to stop the wow. What? How? The enslaved protein sloshing around your suit is the news from which the wow will hang itself. What are you talking about? As soon as I came to an only crew, I tried to tell them to make the toxin that would make the wow with her. But they didn't understand. They put it inside the cabinet and was so infuriating. They needed to take it to Alpha, the fountainhead of the misery we created. And then the girl, she figured it out. She was going to take care of it, but the wow shrieked. saying this toxin inside of me can kill the WoW? All together? You are the snake, Simon. Now strike at the heart. What the hell is that? The heart. It controls all the structure gel on Pathos 2. All you need to do is poison the imprint. And the heart will unwillingly spread it across Pathos.
Jo, das lädt. This has to be fine, right? Hope the Ark made it here in one piece. It's complicated. I just need to know one thing. I'll have both my arms in the Ark, right? Yes, of course. Are you okay, though? Can you do stuff? Yeah. Let's just get this over with. Did you find the Ark? I did, but I kind of lost it on my way here on an automated tram thing headed to Phi. So it should be around somewhere. That's great. Let's go get it. Team? Not really. For some reason, they didn't go through with the launch, so they took the Ark back to Tau. I hope everything's okay with the space gun. Yeah, I doubt I'll be able to repair one of those. A satellite is loaded into a shell. The shell is accelerated by electromagnets along the barrel. Enough momentum to escape Earth's gravity is gained before aggression. Reaching space, the satellite will shed the shell and unfold. Onboard thrusters settle the satellite into an orbit. Okay. This feels like the longest day of my life. Has it just been one day? I have no idea. Our time together is a confusing patchwork of moments to me. What time is it then? What day? It's May 11th, 2104. 3.30 a.m. But I don't remember when we started. You know, I woke up in my bed today. It just happens to have happened a hundred years ago. Sounds like a riddle. It does. I woke up in my bed today, a hundred years ago. <laughs> Who am I? Who am I? It's crazy to think where I am. Not only is this the future, it's in the middle of the sea. I know nothing of this time or what the world looks like. Not much to brag about now. Before the comet, I guess it was okay. Yeah. Better not oversell it. Might change my mind about the Ark. You seriously not gonna tell me what happened to your arm? I had to make a quick stop at Site Alpha to help kill the WoW. What? How? Why? Stop it from torturing the memory of humanity. Okay, let's just get back to work. What will you do when you get into the Ark? 
What's the first thing? Make sure the Ark is safe, stabilize flight path, activate solar panels. What's the first human thing you're gonna do? Oh. Watch the clouds roll by? Does that count? I'd say so. Found the Ark. Good job, Simon. Now we just need to find the assembly space so we can stuff the Ark into a shell. The hero. meters of broken barrel and then push through another 100,000 meters of a dust-filled atmosphere. Will the casing stand all that pressure? Well, the odds aren't great. Catherine, say something. I don't care what you think. 
I'm launching it. No need to be like that. Let's just hang on to it for a while and think about it. We can launch it later. No, that wasn't the deal. We needed to save them, to launch it. Out there, it's hope. Mm -hmm. Down here, it's a fucking terrarium waiting to die with the rest of us. Come on, Catherine, it's not asking much. Let's just think about it before we risk the only hope humanity has to survive this hell. No, we launch it today. This is my project, my arc. It's bigger than that. Don't you get it? It's not for you to decide. We're talking about the fate of mankind. Get away from the ark. I'm taking it. No, you're not. I'm not going to let you ruin this. Stop it. Guys, calm down. Get away from me. No. What the fuck did you do? It was an accident. Catherine, talk to me. Catherine. Oh, God. Catherine. Did you say something? It's you. You had an accident. What are you? Oh. You mean Catherine. Don't worry, it's better this way. Na, mal gucken. So. In Batterie rein. Aber irgendwie. I think I found the assembly space. What do you see? It's like a huge open shell, a bullet ready to be loaded. That's great. All prepared for the arc. On it. How did she die? You got into a fight with your colleagues. They didn't want to risk launching the arc. Thought it might not make it through the atmosphere. They killed me? I'm sure it was an accident. They were just trying to stop you from launching. So, Zef, Tamba, wo ist hier der Launch Button? How could they kill me? Catherine. I know I'm not an easy person to like. I just thought they trusted me. Come on, don't do this to yourself. Ach hier. Hm. Okay. Nutzlast erkannt. Did you have friends in Toronto, Simon? Real friends? They were set it. I'm really not that familiar with guns of any size. Oh, here we go. All systems say go. Lock and load. Come back up and we'll head out to the gun. Do you think the Ark will make it through the atmosphere and into space? It almost doesn't matter anymore. We just need to try. If we burn, we burn. If we're lucky, we just gave humanity a new chance, a whole new era. With the Ark on Earth, maybe we have a few decades of power to keep it running. In space, we have thousands of years. Still, one hell of a gamble, though. This was never about certainty. It's about hope. Now what? Now we just need to get the shell into the gun and then kaboom. Aren't you forgetting something? How are you gonna get us on board the Ark? Don't we need to make another scan? Oh, don't you worry. You don't operate something like the Omega space gun with your bare hands. You mean, it's a pilot seat? Like back at Omicron? Yes, and we can use it to transfer you to the Ark while operating the gun. Two birds and all that. Now, take the Omni tool and plug it in next to the seat and I'll guide you through the final steps. Uh, 
Flash Alien Technologie aufpumpen. So. Jetzt haben wir. Hier ist was nicht. Ne? Satellite is loaded into a ship. Ich bin schon sieben Stunden online. You won't have to. Not after this is over. Right. Have a seat. Comfortable? As good as it's gonna get. Okay, I'll activate the seat. You should be able to use the machines to load the bullet you assembled. How do you operate this thing? Don't know. I never tried this one. But pilot seats are notoriously easy to use, so it shouldn't be a problem. Just hit the button and we're off. But we need to transfer our minds to the Ark. We also need to make sure it launches at all, so I tied them to a single switch. Just push the button and we're off. Here we go. No turning back. Thank you, Simon. Don't mess. It's an amazing thing you did. And I want you to know I appreciate it. Time, 20 
seconds. What's the matter with the upload? Just give it a second. Thought you guys would have better bandwidth in the future. Ten seconds. Nine. This was. <laughs> yeah. Simon like Seven. here. Six. You gotta be kidding me! on the Ark. I saw it. It finished loading just before it launched. Yeah, I saw. Then why are we still here? Simon, I can't keep telling you how it works. You won't listen. You know why we're here. You were copied onto the Ark. You just didn't carry over. You lost the coin toss. We both did. Just like Simon and Omicron. Just like the man who died in Toronto a hundred years ago. No, this is bullshit. We came all this way. We launched the Ark. I know it sucks. But our copies are up there. Catherine and Simon are both safe on the Ark. Be happy for them. Are you crazy? We're gonna die down here with those fuckers living at large on a spaceship. They're not us. They're not us. I'm sorry you feel that way, Simon. I'm proud of what we did. We made sure that something of the hundreds of thousands of years of human history survived, that something lives on. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Fuck this. Fuck this! Fuck you! Fuck you, Catherine! You lied! And I believed in you! I trusted you! You said we're getting on the fucking Ark! We are on the Ark, you idiot! I didn't lie! I can't be responsible for your goddamn ignorance! You fuck! Fuck! Catherine? Please don't leave me alone. Catherine? Catherine? GZ, dass deine Emote freigeschalten wurde. <lacht> Doma. Fertig. <lacht> Doch für... 5,60 Euro. <lacht> das ist ein tolles Spiel. Ich habe zwei Abende Spielspaß mit gehabt. Letztes Mal waren es, glaube ich, vier Stunden. Diesmal waren es sieben Stunden, zwölf Minuten bin ich schon online. Das Intro hat ein bisschen gedauert, also so sieben Stunden. Ja. Kann ich jedem empfehlen, das ist noch bis zum 30. im Angebot auf Steam. 80% reduziert, 5,59 Euro oder sowas. Ich finde das cool. War ein Spielerlebnis und ein bisschen so an Bioshock angelehnt und so. Ich kann verstehen, warum das gute Reviews hatte. Ich glaube, da kommt nicht mehr viel. Ich hätte jetzt noch äh, vielleicht erwartet, dass man die Wahl hat, keine Ahnung, da sich hinzusetzen und zu warten, bis äh, keine Ahnung Strom alle ist oder sich selber irgendwo hinzustürzen. Selbst Mord. Aber eigentlich macht es ja keinen Unterschied mehr. Wir haben die Menschheit gerettet. Ich denke, da kommt nichts mehr.
Na, zur Sicherheit lassen wir das nochmal durchlaufen alles. <lacht> Oh oh. Whoa. Is this? Did it work? Hmm. No eyes. Leicht. Ein Glück, ich habe noch nicht ausgemacht, ne? <lacht> yeah, tolle Simulation. Leichte Matrixfehler. nicht mehr. Okay. Catherine? Catherine! I can't believe we actually made it. Well, we did. I'm so relieved. It's okay, Simon. Everything's all right now.
Ja gut, gegen den Rest des Spiels sieht die letzte Sequenz ein bisschen billig aus, ne? Wir haben es geschafft, sie werden sich an uns erinnern. Irgendwann wird ein Alien-Raumschiff diese Sonde auflesen. Und sie werden sagen, das sind unsere Vorfahren vielleicht gewesen. So, den Abspann haben wir ja schon gesehen. Ende. Gut. Denn würde ich sagen, danke fürs Zuschauen. So mal haben wir schon mal geschafft. Und dann sehen wir uns morgen wieder. Bis dann.